Hello Mzansi and welcome to Art Mzansi. On April the 8th in 2023, South African journalists took to Twitter to comment on the recent arrest of Tabo Besta, also known as the Facebook rapist and murderer. Besta had been on the run since 2022 after he escaped from prison where he was serving a life sentence for rape and murder. The journalist tweet acknowledged the efforts of Tanzanian authorities in apprehending Besta but also pointed out that there were likely accomplices who aided him in his escape and evasion. The tweet specifically mentioned home affairs officials at the border, those who made fake documents, prison wardens and those who helped him scam and launder. The tweet raised important questions about the responsibilities of those who are in positions of authority and those who have access to sensitive information in the case of Bester's escape. It's allegedly likely that someone in the prison system helped him to plan and execute his escape and that others were complicit in helping him to evade capture. The tweet also highlighted the importance of international cooperation in the fight against crime. Bester's escape and evasion across borders would not have been possible without the aid of individuals in both South Africa and Tanzania. However, the apprehension of Bester in Tanzania shows that authorities in both countries are committed to working together to bring criminals to justice. Overall, the tweet served as a reminder of the complexity of the criminal justice system and the need for accountability at every level. It also highlighted the importance of international cooperation in fighting crime and the need for continued efforts to build stronger partnership between countries in this regard.